Hi, right, excuse the mess you might see in the background, bit of a junk room. Right, so anyway, open this box up, and as you can see, this is like the first order I've ever made with Muscle Foods, and I have <laughs> shut Jensen out of the room, because, well, one, meat, and two, you know what he's like when he sees the box. So, uh, let me just get that. Uh, go open put them down there right so we've got some bubble packaging guessing that's my invoice and stuff which I'll look at later oh no it's in a plastic bag so I've got to cut that oh I don't know how good these scissors are so I just found them in a box when I was clearing out a load of stuff let's see Oh, we're getting there. Yeah. Right, and this was... I I uh, got a hamper and then I got another one for a pound or something. And then I upgraded that hamper to get extra chicken um, fillets with it. But then I also bought some extra stuff on the side. Like I bought uh, loads of sausages and some tofu. I also ordered some because they were cheap so let's get rid of this bit of plastic across the top right let's see what we've got in here then shall we oh my back is killing me right, I think I'm just going to get this stump and sit on it because oh my back is killing me and that's still I made when I was in hospital so right let's right this is just an ice pack this is just an ice pack and let's see I got some beef burgers they look all right and some meatballs and what else this looks like one of the ready meals they do high protein sweet chili uh, not too bad for sugar I guess for a meal uh, you know I'll give it a go and then more ready meals because it was part of the handbag personally probably wouldn't get the ready meals but hey ho can but try these things and then this one's Thai curry high protein Looks okay. Uh, and then we've got high protein stir fried chicken. Because I haven't got a microwave, I'll probably have to defrost the meals and then do them that way. Oh, that's the to Oh no, it's split. So I have to keep that to one side and then I'm going to show them that and then hopefully they'll either refund it or. Um, oh, I don't want there's no point sending out a new one, and then that one's got crumbs all over it, but that's not a problem, it can easily be wiped off. And that's a high protein Korean chicken. No, yeah, where are the sugars on that again? Not too bad, I guess. No, uh, uh. so I'm just showing you a bit of white plastic there, right? And then this is the steak. Two packs of them. I'll probably well look because I'll be freezing a lot of this, so I'll probably split this pack and then freeze them individually because you know that's like two meals. I wouldn't eat that as one. Obviously, and the same with the meatballs and the burgers, I'll probably separate them. Well the burgers I won't have to because the packaging it's in. Yeah, I don't think I will with the no, I shouldn't have to separate them because I could probably I could probably get them out once they're frozen because they all look pretty separated. And the sausages. And no sausage. Sorry, I drifted on there off there for a second into a completely different world. Uh caramelised and caramelised red onion sausages and I'm going to be splitting these sausages up into probably packs of three or four 
um, and freezing them. Oh, it's upside down. There we go. And that's pork, chilli and garlic sausage. Yum! And more sausages. <laughs> I know, but sausages are cheap and easy meal to do. And they're so versatile as well. You can do so much with them. So that's why I get a lot of them. And, you know, different flavours. Like this one's chicken and chilli. Lovely. And uh, then there's this one. Keep getting it upside down. I think this is just normal. Yeah, just normal chicken sausages. And uh, what's this? Oh, uh, southern fried diced chicken. That doesn't look very diced to me. Um, but you know, it's okay. I guess it is. It's just because of the way it's flat pack. Uh, well, once I cook it up and mix it with rice or something, you won't tell the difference anyway. Because it all gets mashed up in your stomach anyway. And here's a bit of minced beef. So that's... Yeah, excuse like the pile of shoes and stuff you see in the background. Then we got bacon medallions here. And you got jam and steak here. There's two in the pack, so again I will split that. And what's this? Diced beef. I guess I can see how that is, guys. And um, what we got here? More uh, chicken steaks. Oh, barbecue chicken steaks. Um, what have we got? Uh, this is a big one. Uh, this is definitely a bag that's going to be split. It's chicken fillets. Uh, a big bag of chicken fillets and they will be split up. Ugh. Hope I've got enough bags. And another packet of chicken fillets here. Which again will be split up. You can see this chicken fillet. Chicken fillet breast. And yeah, the other one was breast too. Ugh. And that's everything. And oh no, there's more. Ugh. Just drop them. And then that's just more minced beef there. These, I think it's just because it's like it's portioned for one, two people. That's why it's so little. But that is, um, where are we? Where's the gram? That's 200 grams there. So that's quite a lot. Anyway, this whole box cost me about £75. And as you can see, I've got at least 25 meals in sausages. Maybe more. And then... The chicken fillets, I've probably got another 20 odd meals, and you know, so this is going to keep me going for ages and ages. So, I think it's well, I've not eaten any of it yet, but from what I can see, it's worth the money and it doesn't look too bad quality meat either. So, yeah, that's it.